Welcome back, viewers. In today's tutorial, we'll be exploring how to create a dose response curve using GraphPad Prism. A dose response curve allows us to analyze and visualize the relationship between different doses of a drug or treatment and its corresponding response. So, let's get started. GraphPad Prism provides a spreadsheet like interface where you can input your data. Make sure your data is organized correctly with one column representing the doses and another column containing the corresponding response values. Now that we have our data ready, let's create a dose response plot. Go to Insert and click on New Graph of Existing Data. In the XY dialog box, you'll see several options for different types of XY graphs. Choose the one that suits your needs. For a dose response curve, select the one with the connected values. Once the graph is generated, Double-click on the x-axis and make the scale logarithmic. Additionally, you can double-click in the y-axis to make 100 the maximum value. You can the double-click on the graph and make the different drugs have different colors. That's it for today's tutorial on creating a dose-response curve using GraphPad Prism. Dose-response curves are essential tools in pharmacology and biomedical research allowing us to assess the effectiveness of treatments and analyze concentration-response relationships. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials on utilizing GraphPad Prism for statistical analysis and graphing. If you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to leave a comment below, and I'll be glad to help.